And it's time now for your Motran Minute. Warning Basin drivers first. Of course, we have Dustin Fawcett with the Motran Alliance live telling us about a project taking place in Ward County. Good morning, Dustin. Good morning, Amanda. How are you? Good. So tell us about this project and what's going on. Sure. So this is uh, actually one of those UTP projects that I've been talking about for a while that's in this master plan for TxDOT. And it is, uh, it's actually a project that goes from the Ward County line and the Winkler County line up north into Kermit. It is on State Highway 115. And this is actually kind of a, uh, a southwest to northeastern route that connects uh, areas out there in Wink up to Kermit. Um, and uh, it is a project that is being looked at to be funded going into the future uh, in this huge uh unified transportation program and uh, so it is uh, one that's set out uh, for further dates but it is one that would receive funding which would mean it would make this thing happen if we get it into this unified transportation program. And when would this project begin construction and how much will it cost? Right so this project uh, is in the 2026 to 2030 uh, time frame uh, we do not know the specifics yet, so this allocation is just $10 million out of this UTP program, out of that $600 million that was uh, allocated for the Permian Basin for these Permian energy-specific projects. And because this roadway is energy-related, because of the sand mines in the region, and because of some of the pipeline uh, uh, infrastructure, so some facilities that are located out there, and some rail yards, some short line rail yards out there. Uh, this is a special project that has been bumped up into that. We don't know whether the project is just going to be adding some shoulders to really make that road a little bit safer for a two lane road, or if we're going to get some passing lanes. But this $10 million is, is essentially seed money to, to study which one would be the safest and most cost effective. Good to know. And how can West Texans help? So, as always, we encourage them to go to motran.org, uh, scroll down to the bottom of the page, click the link that says tell us what you think. Let us know if this is a project that you uh, are on board with or if there's other projects, as always, anywhere in the Permian. If it's a state highway, we'd love to hear about it. We'd love to send those down to TxDOT and let them know that we have an abundance of projects we'd love to have funded out here. Uh, we want this place safer. We want this place uh, to really develop, and, and uh, we need your help, the citizens of the Permian Basin. Well, we love your passion, Dustin. Thank you so much for joining us this morning.